All right, so we're gonna we're wiring up some new trailer lights. Super cheap on Amazon. Uh, they've got holes in them, so they're gonna get water in them on the trailer, but it's no big deal. They're LED. They'll be fine. Um, but I want to show this wiring thing. I saw a tip online, and I have used this all over the place, and I love it. Um, so all you do is twist the wires together just like normal, and then you fold them over. If there's a thinner wire, fold it over towards the thinner wire, and then you'll notice I've got the shrink tube up above, and I'll slide this down over this fitting, um, and I'll then I'll shrink. Sometimes I end up picking a shrink tube that's a little bit too too big. Let's see if I can get it on there without pulling this apart. Okay, so then once you get that shrink tube over there, if I can get it, yeah, there we go. Not quite. I'd like it to be all the way over that fitting. I think I may have just pulled it apart in there. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna no, I pulled it apart. <laughs> okay, we'll try this again. I'm gonna use a slightly larger shrink tubing. So. Anyways, once you get that together, I have found that these stay together really, really well, and I've never had a problem with these. Um, I've seen guys do this with just black tape, and you can pull as hard as you want, and that is not gonna come apart. If you combine it with this waterproof shrink tubing with a little bit of the sealant in it, it really makes for a nice fitting. I've used these all over the boat. Every piece of wiring I do in the boat, I do this, do it this way. Um, the key I found is to wrap it really tight when you do the initial wrap. Just get it to go really, really tight and then fold it over on itself. I folded it a little bit differently there so it's a little thinner. Now this will slide down a little bit better, hopefully. All right, and then just take a lighter and light the shrink tubing and it'll shrink up and seal that joint. I use one of these windproof lighters and you go until you get a little bit of that sealant to come out the end you're done. So that makes a really nice fitting. There's no, you know, mechanical piece that can come off like a screw on or those snap fittings. I don't like, I'm sure they work fine, but I just, I like that. It's like a really nice wire. It's bendable so you can move it around and position it where you need it. And then this is just the, the ground that I'm going to run through. When I run these grounds, 